Hi, my name is Beck and I like plants. Now, there are a lot of different things going on in this video. For one, I am filming during the day, which is totally weird. I never even put on makeup before five o'clock at night. So this is in and of itself an anomaly. Secondly, we're talking about real content today rather than just my vlogging experience. I really wanted to get a video out there today touching on this new update about the divorce because it directly applies to me and maybe it might be helpful for someone else out there. So if you're ready to critique me and uh, see if I say everything right, Stay tuned, let's talk about some Star Trek. So first things first, I figure we might as well read about what this update is. I know most of you obviously have already read it so far, however, Repetition doesn't hurt anybody. So here we are moving into the game. We have an event that came out. If we go and check here underneath our little news, there is a cosmic cleanup and latinum rush update. And this went out a few days ago. So I'll be honest with you guys. I read this and then the first thing I did was I started prepping to be able to participate. So let me go ahead and read just the section that we're going to be talking about today because I'll be honest with you guys, this whole top portion here does not apply to me as a player whatsoever and I really don't feel like anything that I say on it's going to make a difference because honestly I don't understand most of it because we're not there yet, but we are going to talk about the part that I'm at. So here we go. We have a new event coming on Mondays to help players level 23, that's me, and above access the divorce. Those who have never built the ship will see a new event Mondays to mine with galaxy consumable buffs active. Completing this event four times will grant enough blueprints to build the ship. Now, what I have heard from other players is that in the past, it's been really not necessarily hard to get the Devor, but pretty time inducing as well as just lots of patience. I think one of my friends even said it took them about six months in order to get this update right here makes it so that way players that do not have a divorce are able to get it in four weeks. And that's like apparently amazing for me. I mean, being able to do really anything that other players are already able to do is exciting to me no matter what. Granted, one thing that I've been running into in general with playing the game is that I've been running into this point to where what's really holding me back from a lot of things are ships. Ships, 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 I'm, <laughs> I'll be real. So moving up in my levels, the number one thing that I've been running into really is the fact of whenever I'm trying to participate in events, I can only do so much, whether that's I can only kill up to a certain level for hostiles. I can only mine as fast as my ships will allow me to blah, 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 blah. Just a couple weeks ago, I actually got a mining crew, which I did not have previously so i was just really depending on my ship in order to do all the mining whenever i didn't even have a crew to be able to do it the game is making it a little bit easier for players like me to i guess have a little bit of a fighting chance on some of the activities and events like i said you even saw in that first paragraph those are things that don't even apply to me however that second paragraph that second little tiny two sentences, that was all for me and I'm so excited. I spent the weekend trying my hardest to get up to Ops 23 in order to participate and I'll be real, it was not gonna happen at all. Um, I still had two more buildings that I had needed to upgrade in order to be able to go up to Ops 23, not to mention the six day timeline on my Ops timer. <laughs> um, but I had some really generous people in my community the other night who gifted me basically some lat so that way I would be able to use speed ups in order to be able to participate in this event today because they saw the importance for me to be able to do that. Now, for those who are newer ish like me, or if you're sitting in that range of the level 23 and above, and you're wondering why on earth do you even need a divorce? Well, I'll tell you why. The Devor is a ship that is specifically made for mining raw latinum at an increased rate. And I think that rate is like 160% um, 
like of a mining rate uh, in comparison to just your normal ships that you would use. What's great about that is as a newer player, it's a lot harder to get our hands on raw platinum. It takes forever. And so something like this is really huge because it allows us that opportunity, not only to get it for just ourselves, but also be able to participate in some of those Latinum events. I think there was one last week and I didn't even try, didn't even try because I just couldn't even do it. So I'm very excited for an update like this that allows me the opportunity to work harder ish kind of in a way to be able to start participating in those events. Another thing is that this ship, like I said, takes a lot of blueprints. I think it's like 120 blueprints. We can check here in a sec um, in order to be able to build. And usually that would take people, what, roughly six months or so because it's based off of events and things like that um, in order to be able to get those blueprints. So I'm very excited because real talk, there have been a lot of things that I know have been easier for me to get since I've started playing just in these last uh, seven weeks that I've been playing. Um, but I know like for a lot of people, this has been more of a waiting game. So I wanted to pull up the event. If you already have a divorce, this is not something that you can see. This is literally just for those people that cannot or that do not currently have a divorce. So I'm going to pull it up. It's under rules of acquisition, and it's literally the very first thing. As you can see, I started doing it this morning and I'll be real. I didn't activate an exocomp, which we'll talk about that here shortly but basically this event says hey like there's a ship it's called the devore it's going to speed up your ability to mine some platinum here are some ways that you can get it so first way is by mining materials now i am in this lovely little section here of only grade three materials so i'm only getting 10 points per one or crystal or gas that is mined all hope is not lost because if you go to this next section having to do with exocomps, if I were to activate one, that gives me a bonus of 40 points. And that, my friends, is what I'm gonna be looking at. In fact, like I said, I did a little bit of mining this morning. I have 135K points so far, but I did that without activating any exocomps. So I'm excited because once I activate that, then that means I will be getting a bonus and I'm excited. We like bonuses here. We like efficiency here. We like being able to make a dent and some of these little daily goals, events, and activities. So I'm excited. I'm going to activate mine here just in a moment and get that mining started. And the last thing that you can be doing in order to gain points is by stealing latinum, both raw and concentrated latinum. This is not something that me as a player that I'm gonna be focusing on, but I think that for those who prefer to be pirates, this is all for you. This is not my play style and that's totally fine to each their own. Uh, but these are the three ways that a level 23 and above that does not currently own a Devore can earn these blueprints. And just a reminder, I can earn only up to 16 today. I can do this event four times and then be able to get the blueprints needed in order to build and construct my divorce. So I'm very excited. These are really <laughs> like things here that make the game just a little bit more hmm, like a fish on a hook situation. You know what I'm saying? I feel like there have been lots of times I've been playing this game where I'm getting real close to something and it's just barely out of reach. This is one of those things that they almost gave me a little bit of something to be like, here you go. This is for your troubles. <laughs> so I'm personally very excited. Even as a person who doesn't fully understand everything about the game, this is something I do understand that this is helpful to me. It directly applies to me as a player, as a new player, as a lower level player. And I know that it's going to greatly help my effectiveness in playing the game. So very excited. It means that I can participate a little bit more in some of the events that come out. So what I'm going to do real quick, um, just because we're here on the video, I'm not going to keep this video for too long because it's already long enough. But what I will do is activate. As you guys can see, I really don't have anything in general because I just started upgrading my building i in fact you guys you can laugh at me all you want but i was not claiming my chips i just i didn't realize i was supposed to be doing that daily but thankfully i had a friend who sat with me for three hours going over all the things i should be looking at daily what they mean 
what everything goes to. In fact, I'm going to be making several videos talking about those things for us newer players that it's just not exactly explained very well in the game. Um, but I'm not going to go into that here. But I did want to admit, if you're wondering why in the world I have like nothing, that's why. It's just because of my own ignorance. So I'm going to sit here. I'm going to activate this for mining. And I made sure that my ship was home before I did that. I'm going to come out here to my system, check out some ore. This looks like a good one. And we're going to mine it. And so while this ship is mining, I'm now going to be getting that boost from my exocomp, as well as that extra bonus of points towards my Devorah. And look at that. Look at that pretty baby. Look at that pretty baby. We, we love to see it. We really love to see it. So while that's going, I'm going to leave that going and hopefully be able to finish up my event today a lot faster. I am just doing ore because as you can see, my station is right next to the ore. And it's a lot easier for me to complete this event doing that. But after this, I will be going out and mining some more crystal and gas because let's be real, I don't have enough of either of those things. Um, so <laughs> I'm going to try to be responsible and do that. I really just wanted to get my face out there and talk a little bit about what this event is, what it means for players like me. I'm excited about it. For those that are curious, no, I do not have my discovery. In fact, that's a whole other topic. Um, <laughs> so we'll get there. We'll get there when we get there. That's really all I have for you guys. I wanted to get my face out there and just talk about this because I was personally very excited because it's something that actually applies to me and it's not just something else that I'm skimming through and seeing that I can't participate in. So I was very excited. I'm sure that there are several players who don't have a DeVore that are also very excited and I'm just happy to be able to offer, I don't know, a little insight, a little input to what's going on in case you guys didn't know. Show those players if you don't have it in your event store, like what that actually looks like for us. So I hope anything, something was found useful for someone, or if not, maybe it was just a little bit entertaining. Whatever the case may be, I'm hoping to release a little bit more about basically noob tips in the future because that's where I'm at as I am playing through this game. So if you enjoyed the video, enjoyed the vibes, enjoyed the content, enjoyed me hit the like button hit that subscribe button both of those things are free ways that you can support my channel and i would greatly 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 appreciate those things otherwise you can find me in the evenings on twitch streaming some of my progress as well as if you're wanting to directly financially support the channel in my about section there's a link tree link that has all of the options for that as well for those who are going above and beyond in that way so <sighs> so much stuff you guys but all good things, all good things. So I will see you guys next time and I hope you have a happy Monday.